do, make the music, Jack. All right, that's as fancy as we're getting today. Hi. <laughs> you know what? It looks like we have hair. It does look like we have hair. This is the hair. So um, I'm Lisa Burbrett of Happy Cat Stitchery with the illustrious. Yes, with the feathers coming out of my head. My name is Martha C. from yeah, the Press Mansion Inn, and we are upstairs in the morning room. I know. That's because I would imagine this. Does this flood with light in the morning? We're looking at yes. a, a mountains. Yes, we're looking at mountains. You know what? We're just going to do this. Just I'm go not going to like it's, edit no, a lot it's today. It's winter day. So it's, it's winter. Kind of dull. We're supposed to get snow. But you can actually go out here. Hopefully you can see through the dirty glass. I'm just letting Thank you see. You. Out. you can actually go out on the porch. It's cold. I'm not going out there right now. But as you can see, the morning room, you could get morning light. So yes. oh, we're back. I'm coming back over here. Good. Good. So, Good. yeah. Um, we are upstairs just oh. for a change. There's like a little... It's almost like another parlor, like yes. another little sitting we'll room. morning room. The morning room. room. We and, have, and there's there's Jacarino over there. And we have like a coffee service, a coffee and tea service over here. I love this. Thank yeah, you. Over here. Oh, and ignore my my big binder over there. Okay. I have patterns. Yay. I have patterns over there. The Hi, binder. Everybody. But that's okay. Um, so we're here with our floss tube video. Thank you for uh, joining us today. We've been getting more people. I you know what, Jack? Well, what is our number? I was just going to say, I don't have you know, a number. I haven't heard anything from everybody that I sent their scones to them, too. So if you're out there, please let me know. I thought I told, I told you someone this. Did you tell me? Oh, okay. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> it's we don't been know. a while. Guess what? It's supposed to snow here on this it's, weekend coming up. Yeah. Here's okay. the fact. We're just really discombobulated after everything with Ukraine right now and the yeah. world going on and gas prices going up. We're and going crazy. Things in... <sighs> Yeah, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Well, we're coming to you today from, like we said, the second story of Hillcrest the Mansion room. in the morning room. In the morning with, room. I mean, we are up here with the stairs and all, but we just have the lovely. 784. Giant. 784. So, hey, we do have some more We're almost doing. there. We're almost Yay. there. Yay. Um, we're keeping this to be a shorter video today. Um, I do have you a major update. really do that? <laughs> That's iffy. We're going to try. Okay. I didn't bring as much stuff. Okay. Whether or not we just keep talking, that's keep another talking. thing. So here's the good thing is we do have uh, the Stitchy Princess Sal, which I'm kind of like getting out there for mm -hmm. a Ukrainian designer. Going to go into more of that in a minute. Last week, I showed y'all a whole bunch of patterns gorgeous. to support Ukrainian designers. I'm not saying don't support Russian designers. We just know that Ukraine is under attack. There's been like... Yes. Hi, we Hi. clipped off for a second because my phone started ringing and for some reason it stopped the video, which I don't know why. Yeah. Well, guess what? <laughs> well, hung you up on know them. who likes to come visit sometimes when we do this. But I didn't tell them. Okay, well, we'll tell them when they get Hi, here. Hi, Henry and Dale. We're Hi. just going to wait from here, you know. I'm going to eat all your snack. No, we don't have any yeah. snacks today. <laughs> no, anyway. It's no snack day. No snack day because we're keeping things really... um. Like small today, and maybe I'll just steal some cookies before I leave. Mm -hmm. And it, we are still participating in hashtag I'm trying to get snowed in, and that's tempting, saying that we might have snow this <laughs> yes, weekend. Yes, Saturday. Uh -huh. Yeah. The Canadians. There's a lot of bedrooms. We'll never send it to us. Yes, is that what it is? So they're, they're trying to get rid of it so that they can have summer, <laughs> spring and summer. Well, we're going to show you the the whip going on the Stitchy Princess Sal in just mm -hmm. a moment. Um, I mentioned another video. I was talking about that before we got cut off just now um, from Ukrainian designers last week. And I had another Ukrainian designer called Awesome. Awesome Magic Studio. Awesome Magic Studio. What is it? What is I, I it? I don't know. I don't know. With Awesome Pattern Studio. Awesome I'm going to show you those patterns. I printed them. So now I have them this week. Last so week. it's like spelled My, awesome in Ukrainian? Yeah. As in awesome that we spell it awesome? They just, that's how they pronounce just, it. Well, I don't know. I'm sure there's Ukrainian words for it, but okay. it's just there. The shop is just, it's in English. The oh, shop okay, is in so English. English. Okay. Uh, well, it I is don't true. Know anything. Well, no, it's true though, because I have patterns here by Maria Bravka, who's mm -hmm. cute patterns by Maria. But if you go and look at one of the patterns I'm going to show you today, it's in Ukrainian. Okay. I did get the translation. Okay. So you're right. Sometimes it is in English. Yeah. Sometimes okay. the shops, it just, it just depends. It depends and if it's not, then hit Google translate. It's just pretty good with keeping everything in, at least I know and I believe in the country that you're at. Um, and I do have some free patterns by some of those designers. Oh, nice. Uh, that is just kind of a thanks for supporting Ukrainian mm -hmm. designers. And like I said, you can still support Russian designers, but let's mm -hmm. face it. 
most of the Russian people don't want what's going on anyway. Yeah. I just know specifically the shops that I'm talking about from Ukraine are begging. We need your support. They are in hot zones. And um, it's not like you can just go out your door and go work. Exactly. So this is our way of supporting them. And I've started it off with this past week, kind of for the month of March, but I really officially started this Sunday. Mm hmm. She's, I got the pattern last week, feeding. got all the fiber, got the, the floss. And so it's this one. It's called rabbit, carrots, and eggs. And we kind of, I'll let you hold it. Kind of like you have to rock it back and forth. There, there we go. You can kind of see, I'm, this paper has a glare to it, but look, see the bunnies. This is an adorable springtime sampler. And so, okay. So last week, okay, Martha, I'll give you this one. Okay. Here's the progress this far. Okay. So with that one, I traded out, hers calls for Ada with weeks diet, with a DMC floss. I use seafoam. Which is a so beautiful. beautiful color by Weeks Dye I want Works. This really bad. Mine's a 30 count linen and I switched out the colors, the DMC floss. I found them in my stash, but then I switched them out. Like here's, I have three different colored oranges. It's perfect for the carrots. Yeah. This one is daylily. And then there is a regular carrot orange. And then this one's persimmon. So pretty. I love those and combinations. And so I am using them to do different carrots and different eggs because you see there's different little carrots. So I'm using different oranges just because I can because mm -hmm. the colors are so pretty and I love the over dyed. It's variegated. See that? Mm -hmm. Really pretty. So this pattern is by Ekaterina Spaniella. Okay. And here, I'm going to show it to you this, the front side again. Um, she is known mm -hmm. on Etsy as the Stitchy Princess. So this is hashtag Stitchy Princess Sal. Okay. Ekaterina. I hope you're still okay. Yes. I know things have been really rough, so we're doing this for you just to hopefully send some more business from wherever our way. I know I've been buying your patterns. And anything helps buy, so they can go buy exactly. bread and eggs. So and then hopefully you will be able to have some better days ahead. Just stay safe and do whatever you have to do. Keep your head down, fight, be safe, leave, come, go, do whatever's best for your family. Mm -hmm. But what's that we know is best for you is to um, help you and other Ukrainian designers by getting your patterns and so we are starting with this one. Mm -hmm. I do have another one I'm going to be doing after this because I think I'm going to be done this pattern in about a week. Yeah, I think you will be. So we'll just have to keep going. So you have the floss uh -huh. there. So it started with, I'm loving the bunnies. Here, I'll let you just okay. This is the first one I started. I just have some and photos right here. Their, yep, you got it. Okay. I started with a little bunny with the big ears. You can I follow these along. Bunnies. Um, on Happy Cat Stitchery on Facebook and on Instagram, I'm doing, 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 yeah, that's it. <laughs> I am updating daily with photos of progress. So here is number two. So the bunny got a carrot. He finally got a little carrot and, and, and little eggs up there. Now I noticed something as I was doing these today, all of the eggs are different. All right. Here's the next one. Yeah. Once you hold that one, all the eggs are different. So you really could, as you go along, you could take the bunnies and the carrots and each egg and do them all separately. And they would make like little ornaments for a cute little Easter tree. That'd be so cute. And this is such a fast pattern to stitch. You could do this now and have this for Easter. So as of today. The colors are just fabulous. Maybe we have white here. Let's do this against Let's the white them. background. Okay. So it's a little wrinkly because I just, I just took it off the hoop. Look, I got those bunnios <laughs> and those carados, but I have quattro egos. Um, <laughs> so, but look up close. Do you see the eggs? Each one has its own little pattern. Yeah, that oh, is so look. unique. It kind of reminds me of snowflakes. My fingernails match. It's so pretty. Yeah. I Mine do. don't. Look. Okay, I'll just go like that. See, <laughs> I, I do it everywhere once in a while. I'm not very fond of it, but I like the ombre nails. Okay. Anyway, back to what we're supposed to be looking at right now. <laughs> We get distracted really yeah. easily. Do, 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 do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so we are still going. So I still have another carrot and some more eggs. And then there's other bunnies um, down along the bottom. And flower. Oh, there's a whole bunch of flowers, like a little flower garden. You could even do this in two sections. You could do the bunnies up top. You could just do this bunny and an egg, which would be a really cute ornament. Or when you do the bottom, which I'm almost to, I might be able to start the bottom by tomorrow. You have the bunny in this little garden. You can almost do it like so a bunny. darling. So you can take this and actually do this pattern a lot of ways if you don't want to do the whole sampler. I've only been doing this four days and I'm taking my time. It stitches really quickly and easily, which is why I say this is perfect for Easter. And 
Ekaterina did just a gorgeous job. And this would be so job. cute in a baby's room. It'd be cute in my room. Yeah, I think it would. It'd be cute in my room. But I love it'd be a the, cute pillow, this, this, couch. the ears right here. I just it's about that, that. I bought that the so pattern cute. for that bunny. Because so he's cute. just kind of chill. He's, now, like, he's like saying, hey, how's it going? How's it going? I'm just chilling. The, the bunnies on hers have like little yellow noses, which I haven't put the little dot nose Aww. on yet. I'm going to do, I have to go find a pink. I want a little pink noses. Be, yeah, because it'll coordinate. But that. super cute. cute. So please go and get, what, if you really, like if you don't want to do this pattern, which is rabbits, carrots, and eggs, she has a whole bunch of patterns in her shop. You can pick another pattern and just it just stitch along for the month of March on, and then show me the yeah, pictures. I, I would love, love to see. You can just comment done. below in YouTube. Uh, like and subscribe too. That would be great. And comment below. And I would love to see your photos of your progress. And I do put in the links below everything we talk about during this episode. So there's a link to uh, the Stitchy Princess on Etsy, her shop directly. And then all of the other designers I talk about today, you'll be able to get to theirs as well, including the free pattern. So there's my little update. It's coming along. It's really fast. It's beautiful. And right now, it's about all the brain and power I can the handle. walls in here. I know. It actually does. It does. It, wait, wait. Let's see. Let's put it up against the See? Look. I'm going to tell you, there's... I'm going to have to go online and look again. There's another Ukrainian designer. I don't have her name. I'm going to find this because I want Martha to see mm -hmm. this. her patterns. Mm -hmm. She has some different samplers and it looked like something that would go in your Martha Washington room. Oh, yeah. Because you like to kind of have a story of like George and Martha. Mm -hmm, I do. So some of her samplers are almost, they're not Valentine, but they're sweet. And they have that like a romance, oh. like a love Ooh, between two people. Nice. And I was like, and the colors match your room. And I keep looking at that. It's it. I'll, I'll find I'll find the designer's name because I'm probably going to get a pattern and print it out. But I wanted you to see it first. Okay. Because I might say, hey, Martha, you pick the pattern and then we'll all yes. stitch it and then you can put it awesome. in your room. Right. I would love that. So, Because it doesn't really match my house, but I'm like, I still love the pattern. <laughs> so my friends like it because those who are into this, yeah. I give them my stuff all the time. And I just pass like, stuff over. I kind of like that. Yeah, sure. Okay, here we go. Okay, um, let's so see cool things. Last week I mentioned uh, Maria Bravko and she's mm -hmm. Cute Patterns by Maria on Etsy. I showed you some of her patterns. I showed you my Diagon Alley Harry Potter cross stitch. Mm -hmm. She's got a lot of Harry Potter ones, but she's got all sorts of things. Mm -hmm. Lovely, lovely patterns. And kind of as a thank you to people who are supporting them right mm -hmm. now, she put out two free patterns this week in several of the Facebook uh, cross-stitch groups. Oh, how nice. So I happened to be on there and I wanted to show you because I do have, you may have already seen these. If not, I put the link below so that you can get this pattern. And I'm showing you the pattern and I can show you the pattern itself, not just the photo if you happen to see that pop up. Because these are free on Facebook. Oh, you don't great. buy these patterns, great. so I am not violating her copyright by doing that and yeah. showing something yeah. that shouldn't be shown. Right. I, mean, I am so being careful smart. on this. So this one, it is in Ukrainian. Yeah, what does that say? Um, I'll let you hold this one up. It's called yeah. Glory to Ukraine. If it's translated, it's called Glory to Ukraine. So there's their symbol, and then the symbol of the country Pretty. is like all of the... The beautiful sunflowers beautiful. and flowers around. Beautiful. So that is a freebie. So Thank let, you for Maria. Well, let me ask you, because I've noticed seeing a pattern, ha, 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 that is sunflowers like their national symbol. It's like flower. a national symbol for okay, flower. Ukraine. Okay, mm -hmm. I didn't know that. So a lot of designers, you will see them right now. And um, actually, Ekaterina has a design, which I'm thinking about getting, which is called Sunflower Girl. Oh, and nice. so the idea is that it's kind of the symbol of Ukraine is yeah. you'll see the sunflower. Besides seeing blue and yellow, which is their national right, flag. Right, right. It's also popular because blue sky and then the yellow of the sunflower, you'll right. often Very nice. see those together. And then speaking about that, this is the other one by Maria, and it's called Stand with Ukraine. I love that. Let me see this. Oh, it's yes. It's so pretty. Yes. Like I was talking, there's the blue and the yellow, and she just made this and like, she just popped both of these patterns out this week. That's gorgeous. That one, super love. I love one. it. And it even I says it, it down here at the bottom in the flag colors, stand with Ukraine. So these are both free. Okay. Awesome. And the links are down below. Just so beautiful. You can down, and I think this is like oh, from Google drive. So it'll pop up for Look you. Look how detailed that is. Look at the wheat. Yeah. It's just beautiful. And I like how she did the grass with a pattern and not just the plain. It, right. It, it has love. so much texture. It's just, it's here. We'll see those are there. Thanks. It's really cool. 
So last week, another Ukrainian designer was living on the rainbow, and her name is, I knew it's Elena. Mm -hmm. I had to, like, go back and look up her last I'm so name. I'm impressed with you. Kovalenko. Elena, Olena Kovalenko. Kovalenko. And she has these really cool stitches that are like little, um, tons of different ornaments. You stitch them and you make them into a, a drum shape. Like a, it looks like a little oh, yeah, drum. Yeah, yeah. And she has little felted roofs and all of her patterns come with instructions on how to make her ornaments. So I got several of hers just because is I that, wanted to know. Is really detailed how to do that, learn to do that? Or is that something easy? Um, hers look easy. I mean, everything's uh, difficult for me when it comes to, you know. I'm new to drums. Loss. So if I've never, I've only made like one and I had to do it the hard way. Don't ask me. That's <laughs> why I don't have instructions for them because yeah. you don't want to take my instructions on them. Right. But you should use hers because it it's was easier than I thought. Cool. But she also has a hundred different mittens, oh. patterns for all of these. And you can actually do all the mittens. And she has a way that she displays them so that they actually make like a Christmas tree when you hang up all the mittens oh, online. Oh, super Which is cool. cute. So she made this one to Glory to Ukraine Mitten. Aww. So that is a freebie, and that's why you're seeing the whole pattern right now. Um, that's from her as a thank you for supporters, for supporting Very Ukraine, nice. the designers. So that's Very down nice. below as well in the comment section. You, you'll be able to download her mitten pattern. And then you should go on her website. Mm -hmm. And her Etsy shop, and just buy the other mittens. Yeah, exactly. You could make that would be so cute as a Christmas tree. It's really you cute. Get on with that one too. You need to do that. Put that on your list. We need that here. <laughs> just I've been doing Halloween designs I'm right now. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. And bunnies. We're gonna get ready for our you know, so fall festivities. There's so already. Much. Okay. Okay. Minasian Yana, Ooh, which very is I'm impressed. Uh, Maya Stitch. Maya Stitch. I'm going to remember. I talked about her too last week. Mm -hmm. uh, however, when I had her, I, I printed this one and I thought I had it. Oops, I forgot. Anyway, so is, this is called Cozy Autumn Design. Okay. Do you remember this from last week? I don't remember that one. That okay, good. New. Okay, that good. New. And I didn't do that wrong. No, okay, I but I love one. this one. Is those nature quotes yeah, so you look, can explain it. Let's go all the way up. Look at each of the houses. It's totally different. So you could... I love patterns like this. You could do each of these separately. Mm -hmm. And then up here, there's a skull. There's a green gourd, little pumpkin house, and mushrooms, and hearts, and little houses, and little bones, and lollipop candies. So every one of those could be an ornament. You could do this all as one stitch, or this could all be separate stitches. So Super I love nice. patterns that you can pick and choose. If you don't want to do all three houses, you could just pick one of the houses, and that would be fine, too. But it's adorable. It is adorable. So my stitch, and I my had that stitch. link on last week, but I have it, you know, darling. Down below, it's really, really As cute. Well. It's so cute for it's fall. It's so cute so for fall. Oh, happy pumpkin. I love it. <laughs> it's just perfect for fall. It's not Halloween. No, so, I mean, so this has some Halloween, Halloween things on there, but yeah. it's more autumn-y. Autumn. It's autumn. 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 Yeah, autumn 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 it's a new language. So autumn. Autumn. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then the other designer, this is the last designer I wanted to show you guys today because, hey, I got to get back to stitching, is Awesome Pattern Studio. Okay, y'all, there's over 3,600 patterns in their Etsy shop. Some are for needlepoint, embroidery, diamond painting, but there's well over 1,000 patterns just for cross-stitch. Wow. Whew. Wow. Wow. Yeah, they've been busy. I guess they've yeah. been around for a while. It's yeah, a lot. Exactly. Um, really great prices on their stitch. I picked this one specifically. They have almost every major city around the world and then like some minor cities because mm -hmm. we have like Roanoke, Virginia. Right. It's not a major like a state capital or New York City, but it's a yeah. big city for here. There's even a Roanoke. Yeah. So you might find a little bit smaller well, city. Big of a city. We only have a Sam, so we don't have a Costco. Uh, yeah, if exactly. If we were a big city, we would have a Costco. Except for us. But I'm not happy with Costco because they took away the dipped chocolate rolled in nuts <laughs> ice cream that I used to eat for my lunch when I went there. They took it away, Costco. I haven't been happy with you ever since. Okay, that was, Is that your goal? That was my AD. First moment. world problems. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're whining because you can't get your ice cream this week. Roll dipped in the chocolate. Dipped. Well, that's fresh. why. Roll into the happened. almonds. Except for the fact that we live an hour from there. Yeah, so, so we don't go. We don't even get to go there anyway. So it really doesn't matter. Just saying. Okay, go back. Go but back. Now. That have, was the commercial. That was the commercial break. Um, yeah. There's tons of different cities, but I bought this one because of our time. This is Kiev. So Kiev, Ukraine. And here's something that you may or may not know. 
when this whole conflict was starting, mm -hmm. I kept hearing reporters say Kiev. Mm -hmm. Okay, I was wondering, is that Kiev? Back in my day, mm -hmm. all Kiev. before, it was called Kiev, Kiev, USSR. Mm -hmm. So when that territory became Ukraine, mm -hmm. the Ukrainians in that language, even though they, most Ukrainians speak English, I mean, speak Ukrainian and, and Russian, Russian and a lot speak English. Mm -hmm. um, in Ukraine, that city is called Kiev. So when you hear reporters talk about that, that is the same city, but out of respect for who owns it and whose country it is mm -hmm. part of, mm -hmm. you say Kiev. And so instead of K-I-E-V, it is now spelled K-Y-I-V. And so this is Kiev and this is in Ukraine. This is the capital city. And so there's tons of different patterns you may find your city. But right now, I just really wanted to get beautiful. the Capital One as support for Ukraine. So really, it's a beautiful pattern. And I think beautiful. that would stitch up, mm -hmm. even if you're a beginner, that would stitch up really mm -hmm. easily. Now, I want you to notice something. So you have the cities and they did these. It's, I call these Let me hold it for you. block colors. So it's done in blocks. You don't see a lot of blending. You don't see a lot of like as much shading. These are like a lot more just standard blocks of color. So it's really easy there's not a lot of confetti, meaning lots of millions of different colors of stitches that make it harder to stitch. It's a lot simpler stitch. But these next two patterns are also by them. This looks hard to me. Yeah. That one's an easy beautiful. one. You it's can stitch beautiful. that. But they call these their mandala patterns. And so I'm going to let you do the cat. And okay. I love this one because it's a French bulldog. But if you look instead of blocks of color, I'm going to let you look up really close. Look at all the shades. There's patterns within the pattern. Oh, that's so cool. Kind of like a mandala would have all the different colors and patterns within it. And you have, there's an orange tabby cat, which reminds you of Rummy. Mm -hmm. But I love this because it's all the patterns. Beautiful. So the cities are in block tones of color, but I love the funky patterns that make. That is beautiful. The cat and the dog. And, and it makes it so interesting. It's so cool. It is so I mean, cool. this would be pretty without mm -hmm. it. Yes. But yeah, hold that one up too. And they have lots of other cats and tons of different dog breeds, not just mm -hmm. the French bulldog that I picked. Um, and then she with it, a French I bulldog. totally want a Frenchie. Okay. Um, we're going to have to figure out how we're going to get her one. But there's multicolors. So even if you find your breed and you have different colors, then you mm -hmm. might find the different colors of breeds too. Cause but like I said, they have over a thousand. It's patterns. like you said. So like we're looking at this cat and this cat has got like a little, little, Little cute patterns inside the like patterns said, within patterns. Yeah, that is just amazing. I think they're really cool. And I so there's all different I think animals. That's very talented. There's like foxes and sloths and llamas and tons of cats. It's like all different animals that you can imagine. And what's the name they, of this company? They're um, it's Awesome Pattern Studio awesome. on Etsy. Okay. So we have it down Put below in the there. show information. But I love this, and you'll probably find your type of dog. They have all the major breeds and some not so major breeds mm -hmm. on there. But I was just like, that's another really, really cool good. studio I wanted to highlight. I know that we are doing the um, hashtag Stitchy Princess Al, mm -hmm. but there's other really great designers out there too. And I think all of those Ukrainian designers need, need the support right all now. Support, yes. And as I finish this, Mm -hmm. um, I'll just go on with another pattern. And then I'm hoping for next month, I am working um, on the Diagon Alley one by Maria right. Bravko. So I'll right. just keep going on that one. So, you know, continue to I'll support just be designers. Mm -hmm. You stitch. And dreaming that she wants to make some cute bunnies. I stitch, you eat. That's right. No, no. <laughs> I stitch and That's eat. That's why you, you say cook. skinny. I cook and get bigger. No. <laughs> Never trust the skinny cook. That's right. Mm -hmm. Hashtag try to get snowed in and get fatter. That's okay. <laughs> so this is what we're concentrating on today and our lovely um, patterns. And I really hope. It's beautiful. It, we have, it's it's going to be so fast to stitch these up before Easter. Mm -hmm. It'll be here before I know it, it mm -hmm. seems. But like literally in the evenings, you could stitch this in a week or two. Easter is it's on horrible. April 16th, I believe. Girl, I will be done this a month ahead of time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Today is. It'll take me that long to get it FFO'd. What is it? The 10th of March today. Wow. Hurry up. <laughs> Where did the year go? Oh my gosh. Yeah. But yeah, this will be done in time and it's adorable. So join me, you guys. And yes. if not, if you're not, if you go, well, I have so many patterns, I can't do that right now. Well, that's okay. Just go but if get you, the pattern. Yeah, get Add the pattern. Do it for next year. Do it for next year. Yeah. 
Do but it it's again. helping someone today. That's right. Yeah. And um, post pictures below. Show me what you guys are making and what colors of fabric mm -hmm. or floss or whatever that you're doing too. And I'm going to get back to stitching. You have some snacks to make. Yes, I do. And we're going to see you next time. Goodbye. Bye. Bye now. See ya. Closing music, Jack. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.